Extra, extra, hear all about it. History according to Bob. Dot com. Hey folks, this is the American Samurai coming to you once again almost live from small town USA. Back again with another audio view. This time we're talking about one of my favorite podcast sites. I have several of his CDs. Well, four CD, uh, four CDs and one DVD. We're talking about history, 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 according to Bob dot com. Um, what this is is a podcast series hosted by a college professor um, who goes by the name of Bob. Makes sense. Um, actually, you will see him on the cover right there. If you look, he's that guy right there. So, for Pat the NES Punk fans, got a little bit of that there. I think, um, I don't know if Bob or Pat did that first, the whole putting themselves on the cover. I don't know which. Um, but anyway, this is a history series. And let's see. Oh, very good. Can pull the paper out. This particular one has about 40... Two episodes. Yeah, um, the individual CD is about thirteen dollars, um, and cover a wide range of topics from uh, World War One to. Well, uh, there's probably not. There's probably a sub. I don't think there's a subject that he hasn't covered at some point or another in that series. I'm pretty sure if there's uh, most of the stuff that he covers, I'm sure if you're interested in any, I'm sure there's some subject that interests you. Anything from the Old West to World War, to Civil War, to the most notorious women poisoners and murderers are just some of the things that are there. This starts at the World War One overview and goes all the way to 42 of Lewis Guns. It would take too long for me to read this, so I'll just go ahead and show, show you the show listing here. Um, this is a spectacular series, and I um, these are MP3 CDs, so you will need a DVD player or a CD player that can play M3, P, MP3 CDs to play it. Uh, but these, I always find his series entertaining and informative. Um, he does a good job. He keeps the narrative crisp and doesn't cloud too much back. And always trying to keep it interesting for his reader. Doesn't the fact that he is a college professor? I think may help. Um, you know, my series like this. Uh, well, like I said, I go ahead and check it out if you're interested in history. Um, there are a whole bunch of other series on his site. And I have, like I said, World War, I've got a couple of World War One ones. And here is Bob's um, World War One Liberty Memorial view or tour. And I have the complete three volume series um, of his Western series, his Western trilogy here. I really enjoy this series. It's one of the series I don't think a lot of people know about. But overall, it's a really interesting series. I'd highly recommend checking out if um, you're a fan of history. Or just curious. I mean, he, you can uh, go to his site, historycoinabob.com or sumahistorica.com. I think I said it right this time. And um, go ahead and listen to his podcast and see if it's something you like. You know, if you like his podcast, he covers a wide range of subjects. Some from most well known to some of the more obscure subjects. I highly recommend checking out. And as for this particular one, I highly recommend checking this one out too if you're into um, World Wars. Because it does it goes in depth into in each individual pilot and the planes and all that stuff that we may have never thought about before because a lot of people assume planes always existed. Well, they were brand new during World War One. So, uh, what do I give this? I give this a 10 out of 10. It's really well done, and I highly enjoyed it. So, um, yeah. Like I said, check it out if um, you're into history. Until next time, this is the American Samurai saying, Sayonara!